Check it out, the light will spark. That's a lot higher. This is the first time we've hooked up Cam's new truck to our boat. Used what? to tow it with the old Highlander, now we got a freaking actual truck so no one can make fun of us anymore. You're a big boy now. Yeah. You got a truck. Anyhow, but we're going pike fishing today, or at least we're going to try to go pike fishing. If you guys uh, have been up to date with the current weather, it has been trash, cold, Rindy, rainy, all of the above. It was super nice we yesterday. to Seattle is what happened. Yes, exactly. Um, and the water temperature definitely dropped. It was in the mid to low 50s, and I'm guessing it dropped into the 40s. You'd probably know better, but anyhow. Um, basically, nice and warm yesterday, so hopefully that got the water temperature up. But we're going to go try some spots on the river. Before we get this video really underway, you can go pike fishing before the seasons open if you fish the river. So that's what we're doing. So before you leave, before you leave your comments, we are 100% legal. So pool four. Yes, pool four on the Mississippi. Not super specific, but you guys get the idea. All right, we're gonna head out of here and try to catch some pike for you guys. Try to actually get some fishing done. All right, we made it out. We're out. We're fishing. Cam's already catching weeds and stuff. Uh, but this is the spot we came last year, made a couple of videos. Um, water temperature is better than we expected. It is in the Almost 50. upper 40s. So a little bit low, but not too bad. So we're gonna see what happens. Just gonna start throwing around some baits, test out some stuff and try to catch us some fish. Let's go. All right, right here I have one of my favorite pike baits, especially when it's weedy. These are uh, Sabeel, it's made by Berkeley. It's basically just a big old giant. It looks like a, it's a jointed um, soft swim bait. I don't remember if I ever talked about this in my pike, uh, yeah, I definitely talked about this in my pike uh, bait video from last year, which I'll uh, link up there. Um, so just gonna throw on that, give that a shot. It swims just like a uh, just like how a jointed uh, a jointed hard swim bait like your bluegill swim baits or whatnot would swim so just like that um, yeah just gonna be throwing that around it's got a weighted belly it's just super super nice bait Almost a top water, honestly. The way you can work these things. You can kind of twitch it with your rod and twitch it with your or twitch it with your reel, depending on how you want it to to be fished. Yep. You got him. He's a giant. So good. Ah, you still got him. Come here, bud. That's something like that. Yeah, he's fat. Ah, 23. There you go. Little guy. He was aggressive. First one on the fly, huh? He boned it in Yeah, he friggin' boom. First one. Gave that one the old lean. There we go. Oh, he got off. Who didn't have it? Didn't have it. Oh yeah, it was hundred percent. There we go. Nice. It was the old flick of the wrist. Not a bad one. No, I need that. You got him. I got him. You drive. 
There we go, folks. Ow. Just inhaled it. Something like that. That one looks like a nail. Sir. No. First one of the day right there. Could be better, could be worse. I ain't complaining though. Yep. There we go. Yes, sir. Good morning. Skinny. Definitely a little male. But just clapped the old fire tiger swim bait. We know they're they're moving when they're hitting like that. I think that was my third hit, so not great odds, but it takes them a minute to get this swim bait down properly, so you kinda go and kinda nibble on it for a while. Alright. My first fish of the day. Can't uh, can't complain too much about that. I only wrecked one, and that's because I ran it into the trailer. Oh, well, that was quick. Whoa! That sounds good. Man, you and holding fish. When I when I say these words to Cam, here, hold him up. He, Cam's just like, what's the dumbest way I could hold this fish? That way. I figured that'll about do her for the day. Uh, not our best day of fishing, but certainly not the worst. Um, water temperature's definitely a little bit chilly, but at least we still caught some fish. Uh, looking for a little bit, uh, a little bit more to that mid 50s, just kind of for an extended period of time. This is also isn't the best pike fishing spot, but it's uh, something to do while we're waiting on our other stuff to develop. So. Yeah, thanks for watching this uh, probably fairly short video. We're going to head out of here and uh, yeah, stay tuned for future videos.